Hello, I am called the NYE. We are uh, bringing you uh, the the visit of uh, Sir Peter Gregory Obi, um, the uh, presidential candidate um, of uh, Labour Party in the last election in Nigeria. Uh, to his visit to the College of Nursing in Adazinoku, in an ultra local government of Anambra State, Nigeria. This man has so much passion for education. Um, <laughs> this is the type of people that should be, um, you know, leading Nigeria as a country, but, you know, Nigeria doesn't want like the best. They always have um, something of um, recycled uh, stuff. And um, his visit is uh, wonderful because uh, he actually uh, bring about so many things. Because this school, he funded this school. And uh, even before he was not a governor, he was uh, funding uh, uh, schools. But uh, when he was a governor, he actually built up this school. And... Um, and uh, make sure that things are happening. And uh, he came there to, um, as um, as he normally do, come there to, you know, give them something that will uh, of benefit. Um, before we continue, I am still called the NYA, uh, the son of wonderful. Please share and subscribe to this uh, channel. We are going to uh, leave you with um, with what uh, Peter B was saying. So that you can know that it's uh, damn serious uh, when it comes to the welfare of people and, uh, and the nation. Stay tuned. Like, please like and also comment.
to the society, to the church, even before he became a governor. He helped us so much as a governor, and I am yet to see another equal to that. I have to see one. And still, now not as a governor, he still helped. Nigerians know what they need. It's only that some few selfish individuals are blocking the way. But once God says yes, you know, there's not a man can say, except but to agree. So we thank you for this gift, and uh, uh, we assure you that this week, you will introduce yourself for the work here. And as you promised us, Oliver uh, Chris always says he wants to know. And he will come back. I know he will come back. Yeah, this is a reaction video. Um, basically, he gave them ten million naira for the uh to help to keep the school running. Um, I do believe that this man has something uh uh something in him that uh, prepares him about uh, investing on education. I do also uh, believe that Anambra State has been blessed with uh, governors that actually um, try in education, especially since Obi left uh, the uh, Obiano and Soludo now. I think Soludo also is um, trying to increase the level of investment in education, which is very, very good. That's what Nigeria should, as a country, should be doing in Education is a great industry and it's a money spinner. And uh, a nation that neglects education, especially education of, of its children, run the risk of having a lot of issue. In Nigeria, I think the education has not been something the government, the federal government and states has invested so much. And that's what has um, created this unequal um uh, spread of wealth and created uh, this connection and also they also need to change the education uh, the type of education in Nigeria because you see a lot of people gone to school gone to universities they come out still they cannot uh, be on their own they cannot be self-sufficient they cannot uh, even uh, you know, do anything because of the type of education in Nigeria. It's not education that meant to uh, make people to be on their own, independent, and contribute to the development of the country. So they have to look at uh, the education, uh, how the system of education, because the one the British left to us, I don't think is, uh, is uh, not of good uh, to the nation. So they have to look at inculcating something people can easily come out after studying something uh they come out they can easily contribute immediately to the society on uh, without actually waiting to be employed in the civil service or somebody to employ them so it's very very important for nation building uh, but p2b is somebody that any nation can be very proud of and um once they come out uh, to vie for any post, he should not be competing with that. Nobody will be able to. But Nigeria is a country of uh, darkness that have love darkness into uh, instead of light. I must stress that so that people will understand what I mean. I am still called the NYE, the son of wonderful. Um, remember to share and subscribe. Thank you. See you in the next video. Bye.